Hi there and welcome to the Heritage Homestead. Today we're going to be talking about some mid and late 19th century photographs. First kind we're going to start off with is an ambrotype. And an ambrotype is a photo that's printed on glass. In this one you can even see that um, some of the image is flaking away and you can see the back of the case. These photos were kept in these protective cases because they were rather delicate. Another type of photo that you'll find in a case is a daguerreotype. These are very easy to, to discover what they are because they're very shiny. They have an almost mirror-like finish and they look almost negative when you turn them to the side. A third type of photo you may find in a protective case is a tintype. It can be hard sometimes to decide if it's an ambrotype or a tintype in a case. And often the cases have lost their little front covers as these have. These are all photos from the 1860s. Sometimes you have to take them out of the case to tell what kind of photograph they are. And sometimes they may have information inside that tells who the person was. Now not all tintypes were put into the expensive little cases. Some were put in little paper sleeves and of course often we find them just by themselves. Now here are some types of later 19th century photos that were printed on paper. This is an egg album in print. You can recognize it because it has a sepia or brown tone. This is the cabinet size of the album in print. The smaller size was often called a CDV or a carte de visite. And these are two little boys. The little toddler boys wearing a skirt like most little boys did at that time. This is a gelatin silver print. It's truly black and white where the album in print is brown. And you can see when you turn it to the side it has a slight sheen to it. So these are some early different types of photographs and maybe this can help you identify some photographs that you find. So from the Heritage Homestead this is Shanna saying God bless you and we hope you have a great day.